So, okay, the book. This is Drop of Dazzle. It's my little mini read. Right from here. And um, I'm going to start by reading the allograms for it. In my deepest wound, I saw your glory and it dazzled me. And the second one from Anne Sexton. Out of used furniture, she made a tree. <laughs> and from that, I'm going to skip to um, a poem at the back, which also has wood in it. Wood is really good, right? Like, does anybody else like need to go hug trees a lot? Like, especially now? Like, I just need wood in my life. I bring home branches because I just want to hold them and feel like there's some place where we're still connected to this earth and this mother. This is called Chinaberry Credenza. And it starts with an, also an epigraph. I always want to call them epigrams, but they're epigraphs, right? Nope, epigraphs. They, they are epigraphs. Epigraph. That's what I said. Epigraph. Yeah. Stop it. <laughs> uh, by Rene Gregorio. Who knows Rene's work? Fabulous, beautiful, beautiful writer. I've been listening so long to the sound of wood splitting. Now I want to know the sound wood makes when it's whole. A line of hand-carved ridges frames two sideboard cupboards. Two long drawers with fleur-de-lis perfect for scrapbooks, a coffin flag with 48 stars, and some old linens. No one really dines anymore. Breathe out that rich wood, mahogany reds, first born in the rainforests of Belize. I pull my life toward me like these small brass handles in my palm. I shine all eight matching legs it stands on, every doweled angle, each etched crevice polished with best intentions, a rag dipped in almond oil, a walnut cracked open, rubbed on the sore spots. This is a good way home. 